Hello, this is Jonathan Landeros with Kativ Technologies. In this week's video, I'm going to talk about a tool in Autodesk Showcase that I think is often overlooked. What's the name of this tool? It's called the Organizer. Now a picture is definitely worth a thousand words here, so let's go ahead and get started and take a look at what this tool does. Here I have my scene inside of Autodesk Showcase. And like most of us are used to doing, I can select components, hide them, and so on just by selecting on screen. But if I go to the Edit pull down and choose Organizer, or click O if you like hotkeys, I get this browser view that lets me go ahead and interact with my model via this browser. I can go ahead and I can select components, hide them by clicking the eye icon, prevent them from being accidentally selected by choosing the arrow. I can also right click and get different options to hide, create folders, group, ungroup, delete, and so on. But let's talk through a really quick example of how you might use at least some of these tools. I'm going to drag my mouse all the way down to the bottom and I'm going to locate the flywheel assembly components. And I'm holding down shift and just selecting them inside of the browser. I'm then going to go up to my icon here and I'm going to put them in a group. Just group them into a new folder. I can even drag components in and out of the folder I just created. Once I do that, I can double click to rename the folder. And now I've grouped those together. Well, what's the point of that? Well, now I can go into my organizer and select that new folder I created and select these in one group. I can hide them, combine them, and so on, and interact with them in that way. It just makes it much easier for me to select these parts. For example, maybe. Maybe you want to hide a series of components quickly for one configuration and then bring them back for another. In another example, you might want to turn off internal components because they're slowing down a rendering and then bring them back later for a different alternative. So here it is, the organizer. There's a lot that can be done with it, so I definitely encourage you to take a look and see what you can do. That's it for this brief video. Have a great week, everybody.